What's up, YouTube? A lot of you guys have asked me to do an updated video for the Windows 10 version of Realtek Audio Manager, but before I only had Windows 8, so now that I have a new computer on Windows 10 installed, let's get right to it. So you want to go ahead and go to click on the little cog wheel here, and then go on Option and click that. For the most part, you want to leave all the top options alone. And when it gets down to Playback Device, you want to go ahead and check this box here that I have here. Make front and rear output devices play back two different audio streams simultaneously. That will help you with the PS22 mixer when you want to separate chat volume from game volume. That way, you know, everything can sound good to you. Remember, for recording device, everything should stay by default. But if not, you want to go ahead and check this box, tie up the same type of input jacks, line in a microphone as an input device. Then you want to go ahead and click OK. Then you want to come here to your, your playback devices. If you don't know how to get here, you would just go ahead and highlight your little speaker icon, right click, playback devices, simple. Then you want to go ahead and click on your speakers, whichever it might be, it'll say what I have here to Realtek High Definition Audio, or it just might say Realtek High Definition Audio. Either way, you click on the one you use, you highlight it, go to set as default, no, set as default here, the default device, click the arrow, bam. Then you want to go ahead and go to your speakers. It should be labeled Turtle Beach PX22. Go highlight it, go down and set default, go to default communication device, click it, bam. Then you want to go ahead and go to recording. For me, I'm using the Blue Yeti, so it'll go ahead and say that for me. But for you guys who will be using the PX22, it should say Turtle Beach PX22 here. Same thing you did with the speakers, highlight it, set as default, default device, and your default communications device, you can do it twice. And you want to go ahead and click OK out of it. But yeah, that's a, this is pretty much just a quick video to, you know, help you out with this. Um, I apologize for those in my first tutorial video that I made that I haven't got around to replying to your comments and helping you. I've been really progressing with that. I'm trying to break that. So if you guys still have any trouble, please message me and comment. I will try my hardest to respond and help you guys to my fullest. I'm trying to break out of that habit and hopefully I will. So yeah, if this video helped you, you know, like, comment, and subscribe and yeah guys, I'll see you around.